Today's video is going to be all about my beauty essentials for after PE when you have a few minutes to get back to class and you guys get to see my awesome workout moves. Just kidding, they're pretty terrible. So after PE, you're probably very sweaty, very tired, and feeling super gross. So I'm going to show you guys my beauty routine and how I do my makeup after a workout. So first tip is to stay hydrated. Drink lots of water, and I know this is not water. It's vitamin water. I don't drink it all the time. Pinky promise. So now it is time to get into the makeup. I recommend keeping a little makeup bag like this one in your locker for after PE. So start off with taking some oil absorbing sheets. These ones are from Clean and Clear. But what I love about these ones is when you open it up, a sheet just like pops out at you which is pretty awesome so anyways you just want to take the sheet and start blotting your face to get rid of any excess oil or sweat on your skin so we can mattify it and your sheet should look super gross right now pretty sweet now you want to take some concealer I recommend taking a stick concealer because you don't need a brush to apply it it's really fast so all I'm doing with this is applying it under my eyes on my nose and any other blemishes that I have on my face and then we want to blend it all in, of course, so you can use a concealer brush, but I just prefer to use my fingers because it's one less brush that you have to carry. And then we are going to be taking a matte powder, so this one is by Rimmel, and using a big fluffy brush, I am just applying this pressed powder all over my skin to set the concealer and also take away any extra shine. And instead of powder eyeshadow, I'm using cream eyeshadow. This one's my Revlon Color Stay, and it's a double-sided cream eyeshadow pencil. So starting off with the pinky shimmery eyeshadow color, I'm applying this all over my lid. And if you apply it to the inner corner, it'll make your eyes look even more awake. And now taking the dark brown side of the stick, I'm not sure if you're supposed to roll it out that much. Oh well, I'm a rebel. Just kidding. Anyways, I'm applying this to the outer corner of my eye and working it into the crease just to deepen up the eyeshadow look a little bit. And then I'm just blending it in with my fingers just so it's not as harsh. Of course we cannot forget about mascara because we want our eyes to look flirty and fun for that cute boy, duh. Okay, so this one is Maybelline's Falsies Mascara and I'm just applying that to my top and bottom lashes. And then for lips, I'm using this L'Oreal Balm Lip Color. It's a really pretty sheer light pink. So you can use any lip color that you want, but I really like this one because it's light and super, super moisturizing so you don't have to apply a lip balm before it. It's kind of like a lip balm and a lipstick in one. So I'm just applying that to my lips. And for cheeks, if you forgot to pack a blush with you, don't worry guys, I got you covered. I got you covered. So all you need to do is take your lip color and that's what we're going to be using as a blush. It actually looks a lot more natural when your lip and your cheek color are the same, so that comes in handy and it's one less product that you have to carry in your bag. So just apply it to your cheeks and then blend it in with your fingers. Now two most important things, deodorant and perfume. These are two must-haves, especially after you've been working out. My favorite deodorant is the Dove Go Fresh Pomegranate. And then one of my favorite perfumes right now has been With Love from California by PacSun. It smells amazing. So I apply it to my wrists and my neck and of course, I gotta shimmy through it guys. And now I'm walking down invisible stairs. Okay, cool. Anyways, now it is time for the hair. So you just want to take your hair out of a ponytail or a bun or whatever you had it in for PE. And my biggest tip is to use a dry shampoo because your hair probably collected a lot of oil while you were sweating. So this is a spray dry shampoo that I'm just spraying through my roots. Then you want to start massaging the dry shampoo into your scalp to let it soak up all the oil and then you're just going to brush it out of your hair and you're going to notice that your hair is oil free and very soft and shiny. And then after that you are finished with the hair and makeup for after gym or PE. I hope you guys enjoyed it and try it out. And now all you got to do is change into your clothes and you are ready to go back to class. <laughs> I can't do it. One, two, three. Uh. This time. What I love about these ones is when you open it up, a sheet. Uh, 
I'm sick, guys. I can't talk.